Hi, I am Sean Patrick Kelly, and welcome to our presentation of Blood Quantum as part of the 9th Annual National Canadian Film Day. First, I would like to acknowledge that the land which I live is the traditional territory of the Wendat, the Anishinaabe, Haudenosaunee, the T, and the Mississaugas of the New Credit. This presentation of Blood Quantum is one of more than a thousand screenings of Canadian films taking place today in every corner of the country and in 40 countries around the world. Through the richly diverse films made in this country, National Canadian Film Day gives us the chance to get together and celebrate all the wonderful stories and cultures that make us who we are. National Canadian Film Day is an initiative of Real Canada, a nonprofit organization that brings festivals of Canadian films to communities and schools across the country all year long. This screening of Blood Quantum is a presentation of SKM Live, the online screening series I curate for my website, skmmovies.com. During the screening, you are invited to join our discussion about Blood Quantum on the Sean Kelly Movies Discord server, the link of which is available in the description. I am so excited to be presenting this free online screening of Blood Quantum directed by Mi'kmaq filmmaker Jeff Barnaby. I first became familiar with Jeff Barnaby after seeing his 2013 debut feature, Rhymes for Young Ghouls, which sadly was what introduced me to the horrors of the residential school system. Blood Quantum is Jeff Barnaby's second film, which I first saw as the opening film of the Midnight Madness selection at the 2019 Toronto International Film Festival. The film follows the members of an isolated Mi'kmaq community who find themselves immune to a zombie outbreak. In my review for the film, I said that Blood Quantum continues Jeff Barnaby's ability to create genre films that provide social commentary on the plight of the First Nations communities. As is usually the case with zombie films, it is often the human conflict that becomes more important to the plot, even though the film features a number of unique and gory zombie kills. I hope you enjoy Blood Quantum.